Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm with a client and I'm going to show you how well these candy color gel paint colors apply to my client's nails. We did, of course, the fills, so we had e-filed her nails, we had added primer, we did the base layer, and then I used, again, canny builder gel, and then I shaped her nails with a file, and we're now at the step where we're applying the color. I will put the colors, the two color numbers below in the description if you want to purchase them. Uh, the blue is really pigmented. I am I could get away with just one coat. I might just slightly go over them a second time, but it pretty much does really good coverage. Okay, so now I'm on my last finger and we're going to cure that layer for uh, just 30 seconds will be good. I've been flash curing each finger uh, until now. So once I'm done this one, I'll stick it in the, my Sun 5 48 watt UV LED light and cure it for 30 seconds like I said. Just gonna grab my totting tool and cut a little bit by the cuticle. Okay, so now you can see that they're cured, how good the first coat was. And like I said, I'll just lightly go over them and I will cure that again for 30 seconds in my LED. Again, I like to use my dotting tool just to remove anything that might be touching the cuticle. Okay, so now I'm taking the other candy color that she picked and it's a really nice gray and again um, with this one it's pretty great coverage uh, you'll see that when I'm done I uh, will probably will do two coats of it but it is covering really nicely with one and then of course that's gonna cure for 30 seconds each layer in the LED again so I'm going over with my second coat now I always prefer applying color with my square brush, as you can see. Definitely my favorite to use for doing color. Okay, now I'm taking my Mori Sculpt and Shine, and again, as you've seen in previous videos, I am just uh, applying it to the top to give the nail the shine, to fill it in, to fill in any grooves, make sure we have a nice uh, C curve, and then this gel cures for a minute and a half in my LED. I 
I definitely recommend the Canny Gel Colors. I've had no issues with them and they just uh, apply very nice. This is the Amore brand, like I said, the Sculpt and Shine, but I've heard you can take the Canny Clear Builder Gel and the Canny Top Coat and combine them 50-50, and you can use that as your top layer, as I'm doing with my Sculpt and Shine, because I do like to have a little bit thicker top coat so that I can make my nails the way I need them to be if I'm needing to add anything or... Uh, it's just the way that I do nails and so I think when I'm done my sculpt and shine here I'm going to do a mix of that and you'll see that in some future videos of me placing that on top of each nail to give it the shine and to fill it in. I just flash cured these nails each time and like I said I will be doing it a minute and a half once this thumb is done the whole hand will go in the light Okay, now that it's cured, I'm wiping the inhibition, the sticky layer off, and what I do at the very end of my service is I just go lightly underneath the nail. I don't do the sidewalls, it's just the underneath to remove anything that might have gotten under there, just to make sure it's not sharp and smooth. And then when I'm done that, I will be applying cuticle oil to the nails and you won't see it in this video, but she will also get lotion. Well, everybody, I hope you enjoyed watching. Again, I recommend the Canny Gel Colors and uh, they will be in the description box. Please like and subscribe. Bye.